In this lesson, we'll introduce Hot Reloading, which is one of the coolest features available in our React app generated for us by Create React App. Hot Reloading means that we can make changes to a file, save the file in our editor, and see those changes reflect immediately in our running React app in our browser. So before you start this lesson, make sure that you have your React app running. That means if you shut it down in your terminal, you have to go to the location of your React project and run npm run start in your terminal. So when you go to localhost port 3000 in your browser, you should see this React logo rotating, and that means that everything is working correctly. And what we're seeing rendered here on screen is actually our app component in app.js. So we are seeing this content right here on the screen. You can see here is the text that says edit source slash app.js and save to reload. And it appears right here on the screen. Well, let's go ahead and follow its instructions. So I'm going to remove the entire text content in between the opening and closing paragraph tag. And I'm just going to write, I'm super excited to be learning React. And of course, we have to add an exclamation point because we are super excited. And notice what happens in the browser as soon as I save this file. You'll notice the content will automatically update without forcing a page refresh, without requiring us to restart our React dev ser server, we'll automatically see this content. And the same rules will apply as we make changes to any component within our directory structure, within our source folder uh, in our project. So you don't really have to wait long to see the effects of your changes, which obviously encourages a very active uh, approach to experimentation when you write React code. You kind of have this trial and error feedback loop where you can see if something works, see if it fails, and then continue modifying your code very quickly and seeing uh, if you get the result you want in the browser instantaneously. All right, so that is hot reloading, also called hot module reloading. That's all there is to cover in this lesson, and I will see you in the next one.